it is minus a million. Oh, hello. This is Canada. You get a nice orange tarp to keep the heat in. If we were playing a round of the floor is lava, we would all die. <laughs> I can't get through that way. Oh, this side's clean. Why aren't you working, Mer? Uh, consultation. Ah, uh, are you adding that to your fee? Yes, yeah, so I'll put it on, uh, on account. So, like, there was that lady that asked if we was single or looking on the on the video, the last video. Yeah. And uh, my mom said no, but she's interested in trades. Oh, <laughs> so there you go, people of the world. Mer can be <laughs> traded for. <laughs> Down like, for a, you know, like a fancy dishwasher, maybe? Yeah. Know, something like that. Yeah. <laughs> a new puppy. Well, as long as nobody offers her a condo in Victoria. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> in which case, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> so it's minus like 48 or something here today. It's freezing. But he's working. And what? working so I thought we'd maybe do some like polishing ASMR for all of you people who love watching Mer polish also look I chopped off like an inch of my uh, and a half of my hair all by myself it was a moment of crisis and then not of crisis so yay all right Mer walk me through what you are doing right now we are taking off the excess patina, but leaving just the right amount of patina. <laughs> so, how do you know what the right amount of patina is? I decide and he deals with it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good system. Yeah. It's a good system. Yeah, the, the, it's, it's similar to the system where I tell him what to do and he does whatever he wants. Right. Yeah, it's the same sort of idea. Accurate, yeah. accurate. That's right. And uh, If there was anyone else. Yeah, I would call them. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you using to do this? This is polishing compound. That's a, a slight abrasive. It's going to take all the stuff off here and then try and get it from dead and awful to shiny. Right. But the problem is there's some kind of something that's on both sides of this car. So when it was a little baby car 30 years ago, somebody put something on it and we tried every chemical I have in the garage to get it to dissolve and it will not so I don't know what it is it's not subject to any kind of a chemical like water based or reducer or anything so I'm cleaning it as good as I can and we'll just see what comes up oh. problem being if you go too far through it then it gets to be all of this which is the primer underneath right which a little bit is okay but not too much. Oh, okay. That's what we're doing. So this stuff is actually like eating away at the first coat of... Whatever's on the, on the top of it. The so, it. Mer, I noticed then that you're not wearing any safety equipment. No. This is not a grinder. It does not throw stuff at you. you see, it's a random orbital. You see, it does spins like this, but it also spins like this. You can put your hand on it so it doesn't, doesn't hurt. It's not oh. like a grinder that spins any braids. It, it goes sort of... So we're still we're safe. Very, we're very safe. Yeah. No one will die today. Nobody will die today. <laughs> that's always the goal. That's always, that's always the goal. Nobody yes. will die today. Yeah. You should do a door. I should do a door? Yeah. I don't think Mer will let me do a door. Absolutely. Oh no. Okay, I'll do a door. Can I do a door? I'll do a door. See, I've finished the first part of this, so you can you can do this part right here. It's nice and easy to do. Okay. I'm gonna do the thing. So we're gonna put a little bit of polishing compound on here, like this. And then you're going to put it up against it. Here's the on-off switch here. Okay. On, like this. And then what you're going to do is you're just going to go back and forth like this. All even pressure, All I'm even assuming. Even pressure like this, and then 
this. Okay. Okay, back and forth. There you go. Sure. Well, we'll see how this works. Okay. <laughs> okay. Woo! Ah! Okay, okay. there you go. And off switch. Just, you just put it on before I touch the car? Yeah, you can. Touch the car. about a foot by a foot. Like I know what a foot is. Like that. <laughs> yeah, that's it, just like that. And you can see these little black things like this. That's, that's what you want to get rid of. Oh, but okay. people back, of course, so it's even. And this is the stuff that I'm trying to get rid of but can't. That's the foreign substance. So we're going to do as much as we can, but we can't get rid of it. Okay. I'm trying to hold it flatter like that. So the center of it is as flat as it can. It just, it just hit this thing, so you don't, oh. you don't want to, okay. So I'm going to turn it upside down, and then just put the, the goo on it. Okay, now you got to, I don't turn it on now, because if you turn it on now, right, it all, all over spray. your face. So you want to touch it to the car, and then turn it on.
And if we had a little polishing cloth here, then it just gets residue off and it starts to get shiny. Look at that! So now it looks like this and it used to look yeah. like that. I did it! Now you can do the key next year. <laughs> no, you guys can do that. You put me out of a job. I, I'm <laughs> no, done. I'm going to keep you employed, Mur. <laughs> that, like, my arms hurt after doing that. You feel all jiggly. It's like, no, it's like it's like a shake weight. You remember when yeah. shake weights uh -huh. were, shake weight, shake weights were a thing? Well, that was fun. Thanks, Mur. Just another service we provide. <laughs> Mm -hmm. What would you say is probably like the number one mistake people might make when polishing? Well, you have to start off with something as clean as you can and you have to make sure you don't use too aggressive a paste like this. So you have to look at the type of surface you're working on and if it's really rough, make sure it's really clean and start gently as if you put too aggressive uh, grit on here, then you're gonna go through the paint. So you wanna start off a little bit, do a bit at a time, see how it works, and take it from there. And that's your mer moment. Do you think having like the oldest paint possible is the way to go? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, starting with something that's... Would this be easier on like a 2017? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yes, starting off with 70 year old paint Neglected is not. It's not seven year old paint. A paint. I got barbecue in that. I see it's 65. 65. <laughs> yes. <man. laughs> Jeez, the mathematicians in the comments. I know. It's a combination of Murr's sexy and they just know everything about man. <laughs> the ultimate combination of man. <laughs> what, send me a link and DD Speed Shop will sponsor the. <laughs> The twenty-five dollars. What did you find on Amazon, Rare? A little kit of very, very, very fine polishing discs. And then Murr can review it because yeah. if Murr likes it, that's how you know it's going to be good. If Murr likes it, you're so like yeah. you're golden. If Murr doesn't like it, don't buy it. No, I'm afraid that's not, not it. This is an experiment. I'm a long way from an expert. You know? <laughs> that's what you put in so good here. Uh, no, an expert is like the ammo channel. Yeah. And that, that guy is, he's the, I, I can't even hold his shoes. That's You're the like, expert we can afford. That's, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> that's the difference. He's an expert. I'm the expert you can afford. <laughs> that's about the size of it. I work very slow, but I don't charge very much. <laughs> <laughs> that's why we like him. Well, that's why we like him. That's really <laughs> and he cooks a mean steak. Yes, that's true. I think I've had, I have had compliments on that. 